What's up everybody? Switch Whisper. We're back with another switch. This time it's an OLED. And we got the orange screen. So you can see we're looking at the Wi-Fi chip. Um, we're gonna just try a reflow. Although we do have a new chip if that doesn't work. I'm not sure how much different the regular switch from the OLED for the chip because uh, we can see this one let me try to get this in the right angle if I can even here there we go well, I just put that on there but you can see KUBG there on this chip let me just clean that off a little we can see right there it says KUBG oh now I covered it anyways we'll just try the reflow see if that fixes it if not we're gonna replace the chip and go from there I've adjusted some levels hopefully you guys can hear me a little bit better now um, I've got a mic that kind of comes around to the like to the front hopefully that'll fix some issues but I'll just minimize my talking while the fans and everything are on um, but yeah we're just gonna reflow for a couple minutes here at I'm at 420 and um, and yeah see and then just give it a little tap see how it goes I'm just gonna adjust my light here because it's in my way, kind of. get this angled enough so that you guys can see what's going on Looks like caps are starting to get a little shiny in the top there. Some shiny caps on top so I'm gonna get in here for just a light poke there we go oh <laughs> I touched that one too but that's okay this will hopefully settle it down and get that one down
Friggin' might have had troubles to end. So it's just. Hit that one again. Okay, so we'll let it cool off, we'll test it, and then go from there. And yeah, so the, my last one that I did, the last switch I did that was a video actually, uh, and I just refloated it and it seemed to work fine for us but then customer took it home customer ended up coming back with the same problem so then what I did is I just replaced the chip and worked again and customer hasn't been back since so the worst case if you get that orange that dreaded orange screen you're just gonna have to replace the chip. Now that's kind of the worst case scenario. But uh, reflowing, especially with something like this one where customer said it was dropped. So it's very likely that it just, one of the little, uh, of the 50 some balls that are underneath this guy is probably disconnected. So that's why we're just trying to do this first. I know we could get it cleaner in there. It's just a little tough because it's like a it's like a bathtub here we're dealing with. And there we go. Well, so there we can see a little bit better. So this one's the CYW4356X KUBG. Um, the one that we have, it looks like it's a recycled. Um, and this one's the BCM4356X KUBG. Uh, I mean, we're hoping it's the exact same. But there's no, I don't have a source for these OLED ones yet. Um, let's just test it and we'll go from. And I've got this guy here. This one's going to be a fun one. We have a couple pins missing on this connector here couple of these pins missing so I'm going to replace that connector we'll do a video for that one too if we get a chance to yesterday I did a very comprehensive uh, pad reworking and I wanted to do a video but we had the uh, the neighboring wall here they were drilling and hammering and it was quite tough to just do it and I didn't want to give you guys a shaky video because who knows if you would have learned anything. This is a bit of a pain getting this part in. But I find just flexing, flex this bottom piece here. 
See, because it flexes down. It's just plastic. Okay. Don't need that. Just need power. Button. The screen. LCD connector. Don't need the fan. Uh, we might need that for the antenna, but I won't worry about getting too crazy on testing it until I've actually seen that it's getting past the orange screen. If it gets past the orange screen, we'll make sure we plug everything in and we're going to full test. But right now we just want to see if uh, did we fix that orange screen <laughs> sorry this thing's tickling me I switched my switched the mic to this guy it's just like fuzzy hair and I've got it up farther to my mouth now so hopefully this is giving better feedback I was I know I was mumbling I tend to mumble you know I had a comment in my last video that is very difficult to hear so that's what we're we're hoping for a better <laughs> a better audio on this one okay here's the moment of truth and battery's dead yeah we had this guy Overnight, uh, it was just orange screen. You couldn't turn it off or anything. I didn't want to Didn't actually have time to open it up To unplug that So what I'll do is I'll just use a Fresh battery here And just see if we got look at this. Reflow to the rescue. Round two. So yeah, we're going to <laughs> look at this, it's brand new. So yeah, we're gonna hope that's it, that it won't need anything else. Uh, orange screen ideally is fixed and uh, yeah we'll we'll do another video if this one comes back if this thing comes back um, and it needs an actual replacement I'll do another video for that one um, but that's all for this one switch whisperer out